Okay, I have a camera on the DODS 1000 on the screen to show. I have here the MIDI sync with the DODS 1000. I have here the, um, the, the, the beat maker. I, I have here the sync non-bar and we will start with non-bar. Okay, uh, the Ableton start stop sync is activated in record box and also activated in uh, Ableton Live. I press start. Okay, I don't have to speak more. You hear that the beat is not in sync. Um, I go back to the DLS 1000. I mark it here again that you can better see. I go back here on point one. Okay, this did not work. Uh, let's start it not from the DLS 1000. Let's let's start it uh, from the Ableton Live. <laughs> You hear also again, it did not work. Okay, let's stop and go um, and quantize it with um, one bar or with a half bar. Hmm? That it goes faster. Uh, but let's do it with one bar. Okay, we have one bar and now I press start on the DDS 1000. Please also look at the screen of the DDS 1000 and Ableton Live where the bar is. Now you hear the beat is in sync but the bar is not in sync. You see that you have now 8 bars, 12 bars, and you see on the other side that the beat and bar sync only is in sync with Ableton Live and with the DLS 1000. But it's not in sync the bar with the record box. So this is a problem if you have a sequence in the DLS 1000. The sequence is not in sync with the bars in record box. Let's go again back and say, okay, I want start. I will start it not from the record box DJ. I will start it on the Ableton Live. I have on the right side, I have a sequence. I, can, I make another sequence. This one, this is a sequence with four bars. And now um, the first four bars is this sequence. And then we change to this sequence, okay? Okay, let's go and start with Ableton Live. Okay, I don't have to tell you more. The Ableton Live starts very speed and late again. We have four bars now on too late. We are four bars too late. Only in sync with the um, Ableton Live and the DOS. I will change now to the next. Okay. I have to make stop because I have the, the noise out. But you see it. You see that the, that the sequence was not in sync with record box. And this is a big problem. If you have, if you have a step sequencer, the step sequencer has absolutely must be in sync with the bars on the record box DJ. But it did not work. When I press start on record box, it don't start absolutely in sync with the bar with Ableton Live. I show you again now with the noise on on the DDS 1000. And now you see, bam! On the left side the four bars are over but not on the right side. He is in sync. Oh my god! But not in sync with Record Box DJ. It's absolutely horror. And everything I test and check out to fix this problem did not work. I make only four bars in uh, the DLS 1000 and then open it to uh, the things bar. I will show you.
I make this that I only have four bars and then open it, but it, it's, it's not in sync. The DDS 1000, no, the record box is not in sync with Ableton Live. If you quantize it, it was in sync with the beat, but not in sync with the bar. And if you use a step sequencer or you have Ableton Live and you have sequences programmed on the, uh, on the, on the lines here, it also was not in sync. So, Please, I don't know what I can, I wait now more than two years that the DRS 1000 is synced with Recordbox. It's only in sync with the Ableton Live, but I did not understand when, why did you, oh, why did you not make Recordbox in sync with Pioneer DJ? Now you, you, now you do the Ableton Live protocol with Recordbox, but your own protocol, the Pioneer DJ link, it was, it did not work. I really did not understand it. I will show you again with a half bar, okay? And you can do it with... Too late. I make a quarter bar. Too late. I make an eight bar, eight quarter. Not really in sync. Not in sync. So, um, what 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 must I do? What must I do? What must I do that it works? No, not in sync. I go 32. See? No. Not in sync. So you see that it did not work and please pioneer, you have wonderful products, Recordbox and the DOS 1000 and I did not understand why you could not make these great products in sync. Now you say Ableton Live works with Recordbox. No, Ableton Live did not, did not work with Ableton Live. As you see, F, only the beat, only the beat sync, but in Ableton Live you have bars, you have you have not only one beat. So please fix this problem. Thank you very much. Bye.